English, we chose our beast and then we researched it. Then we wrote a summary on it in an art. We sketched it out on paper after looking from out a picture. And then we gathered all the materials that we needed, glued them or taped them together, and then started painting or paper mache. And then painting. Then a hero came and was challenged to kill the beast because. There was a note sent from another king to kill the hero because he offended the king and he thought that the perfect way to do it would be to have him killed by the chimera, but the hero ended up killing him with the help of Pegasus and lived. This is called a cyclops. It, um, yeah, it has. Do you, can you count how many eyes it has? That's an eye. Can you count how many there are? One, right? It only has one eye. It's not, it's not like us. So you know how we all have two eyes, right? Well, it's not like us. It only has one. Those are those are its toes. You know how like in your shoes you have toes, so you have toes, right? Well, this it doesn't have shoes, and it only has three toes, and it only has three fingers. Do you have any other questions? Why does he have this one? Well, this is just like clothes. Like you know how you you wear clothes when you go to school or when you go out. He it's the same thing. He wears clothes, and you can. Feel it. It's kind of like soft, it's just like touching. your How many heads do you see on it? Three? What kind of, what different oh, animals, what different animals you know are what there? what the orange juice comes out of? No. Uh, what you pour it out of? I don't know what the other Bottle. Good job. Well, the to, body a is goat? actually an orange Does it look like a goat? And then yeah. the head, this is well, probably going to be a lot He's lived in chicken, volcanoes and that's why they can breathe fire. be made out of? I made the python, this one right here. Uh, it's a giant snake that breathes fire. I think that And um, it protects a mountain called Mount Parnassus. But it was killed by Apollo because he wanted the mountain for himself. And, and But Apollo didn't give him a fair fight. So he's always going to be angry at Apollo because Apollo just snuck up behind him and killed him. But he was born in the mud when there was a giant flood, and so he loves slithering in the mud, so that's why he's all muddy. And um, he has big fangs, because he always hunts down humans, so he needs big fangs for that. And we then we put like, newspaper all around it, and then we painted it and put, put like shading in like that, and then we put we the new like looks like half a Barbie doll. What? That looks like clay. Yeah, that's clay. And then oh. this is just oh. like a pop Oh, a minotaur is a beast that has the body of a man and the head of a bull, and it protects the labyrinth. What did you draw? What is that? A minotaur. Did you draw your favorite one? Do you remember what it's called? No. No? Do you want to show me which one it is and I'll tell you what it's called? Which one's your favorite? That's what you drew? Okay, let's hold your drawing next to it. Let's see how okay. similar they are. Good job. Wow. Look at that. You have the saddle and everything. What is that animal called? Can that is a uh, Xanthus, the mortal horse. Xanthus. You can look around. Slimy and they're squiggly. Well, that's what their legs were believed to be made out of, and they lived under volcanoes. And you know how volcanoes erupt a lot? Well, they thought when volcanoes erupted that these beasts were waking up. <laughs> Well, I, I took this a one was made out of a bottle. 
and I cut it off, I cut the bottom and rolled it around the bottom of the Coca-Cola can, and I took this pepper bottle and rolled the part of the Coca-Cola can and put it in the bottle and taped it together so it would stick. Then the arms yeah, made them out of styrofoam. This part right here, the arms are styrofoam. Just about, and then paper mache over everything. What do you know about the Cyclops? Uh, that uh, they have one eye.